Hey guys, what's going on? It's Osas here with iPhone Hacks, and I'm going to be showing you how to reduce high data usage on your iPhone or iPad. So the first thing I'm going to show you is turning off cellular data usage for iCloud. So here we jump to the settings app, we go to iCloud, and then in iCloud you're going to want to click on iCloud Drive, scroll all the way down to the bottom where you see use cellular data, we're just going to toggle that off, as you can see mine already is, um, and this will just obviously prevent the iCloud from racking up data fees as it updates your pages or your Safari links on your other devices. Next up I'm going to be showing you how to disable automatic downloads on cellular data. So again, we would go into <clears throat> the Apple iTunes App Store, we'll scroll here and you'll see use cellular data um, for automatic downloads, you're going to make sure that's toggled off. Next up, we have Wi-Fi Assist. Now, Wi-Fi Assist isn't necessarily a terrible thing because if you do have weak Wi-Fi, it'll use your cellular ne network to kind of buffer that bad service. But obviously, if you use your cellular network, you're using your data, and sometimes you may not know that this is even occurring. So in order to figure that out, we're gonna go into the Settings app. We're gonna see, scroll to Cellular, and then in Cellular, scroll all the way down to the bottom where it's kind of hidden and we're gonna turn off Wi-Fi. So as you see, I've only used 44 kilobits, but obviously if I use more than that, it'll be listed there and that'll probably push me to, to disable it. So as you see here, Wi-Fi Assist is off. And as it says, automatically use cellular data when Wi-Fi connectivity is poor. While that does, of course, help in certain situations, you will use data. So you can toggle that off if you're trying to save your data usage. Um, next up, we can monitor and disable data hungry apps. So again, we can jump to cellular and we can see the, the apps that are using cellular data and then you can see the amount of data that is actually being used. So you can see I've used 23.1. Um, for Chrome, uh, Facebook down here is 22.7. So if there are some huge data hungry apps, like if I used HBO Go and I streamed HBO Go, that cellular data usage would definitely outnumber any of these apps on here. So if you do find something that's completely egregious, you're gonna of course just toggle that off. Um, next up, a pretty common um, trick is to disable background app refresh. So you're gonna jump into the settings apps, which we're, which we're already in. We're gonna go to general, and we are going to turn off background app refresh right here, just by toggling that off. Um, so that's really it. Next up we have avoiding streaming high quality music. So if you're streaming music on your device that's fine and dandy but if you use the high quality music option that'll actually increase um, the amount of data you're using. So we're going to go into music. Here you see where it says high quality on cellular. We're going to want to toggle that off because it streams it at its highest quality. That means the files are bigger which means you're using it more data for the same song you would listen to without this toggle on. Um, if you want to just cut it off completely, you can of course toggle off use cellular data for all, any streaming or download music or movie service. But uh, Next up, I'm going to be showing you how to disable autoplay videos on cellular networks. So if you have Facebook like I do, and there are tons of videos that people are posting that play automatically, you can disable this by going to the settings, so I hit that more icon. Of course, it's settings, we'll go to settings, account settings, and we will scroll to videos and photos. And here, where it says autoplay, we're gonna either put it on Wi-Fi only or never autoplay videos. I hate autoplaying videos, so mine is always off. And we're gonna do the same thing for Twitter. You can do this for other social media platforms that you use, but these are the two of the most popular ones. So again, we're gonna go Go home, Oops, excuse me, go to the me profile, click on the gear, then we're going to go to settings, and where it says video autoplay under the general headline, we're going to either put it on, again, never, never play videos or use Wi-Fi only. And that way you're definitely saving on data because you're not having videos playing and taking up data on your phone or your iPad when you don't even want them to play. So that's a definite improvement. Um, and then lastly, we can turn off cellular data completely. So we can jump into settings, 
scroll up to the cellular app right here and where it says cellular data on the very top you toggle that off and you won't use any data whatsoever so that's the last resort um, that's just if you're right at the peak you're about to go over your gigabytes limit and they're gonna charge you eighty dollars or something insane you definitely want to turn that off so you don't even risk accidentally streaming or playing some video with data so those are the tips of decreasing your data usage um, they're, they're pretty simple make sure to check out the full article for more details on each tip and um, if you found this video helpful make sure to hit that like button and also make sure to subscribe to our channel for more videos just like this alright guys thanks for watching